Welcome back to my channel. This story is penned by MMA fighting staff in SB Nation. Sean O'Malley, born October 24, 1994, is an American professional mixed martial artist. He currently competes in the bantamweight division in the Ultimate Fighting Championship, where he is the current UFC bantamweight champion. As of March 12, 2024, he is number 6 in the UFC men's pound-for-pound -pound rankings. O'Malley trains in Glendale, Arizona, at the MMA lab led by head trainer John Crouch, and is coached by his longtime friend, Tim Welch. O'Malley was given the nickname, Sugar, by one of his MMA coaches in Montana early on in his career. O'Malley fought his first five fights of his career in his native Montana, before leaving to fight in North Dakota and eventually fought for Legacy Fighting Alliance where he got a highlight reel knockout over David Nuzzo. O'Malley's grandmother is Irish together with his friend and head coach, Tim Welch, O'Malley is a co-host of their podcast, The Timbo Sugar Show. He was previously following a vegan diet but has since gone back to eating meat. O'Malley is an advocate for legalizing marijuana. O'Malley is married. He and his wife have a daughter, born in 2020. UFC bantamweight champion Sean O'Malley had quite the unexpected weekend on his gaming livestream. About an hour and a half in, to my stream, I saw AF asterisk King Cop fly down the road, O'Malley said Monday on the Timbo Sugar Show. I feel like instantly I kind of knew because I've heard about, some of the big, big streamers getting swatted, people find out where they're at, then call the cops, and say something happened that obviously didn't happen, and then their f asterisk king getting swatted so I peek out my head out the window to see, maybe the cops were, busy, maybe it was something else. But then they're on the intercom, and I see a bunch of cops, and they're like, walk out with your hands up. So I f asterisk king walk out, hands up. I was like, I'm just going to listen. I could get shot, you know what I mean. Like, sh asterisk t, O'Malley continued. I was like, if I just listen to them, I'll be alright. But you never know, someone sneezes, and pulls the trigger. I've got shotguns pointed at me, like ARs from like four different cops pointing at me, and I was like, I'm just going to listen, and F asterisk king walk back. I was sitting in the back of the cop car with handcuffs, and I was like, dude, that's crazy. I had freedom five minutes ago, now I have none. Zero. And I'm like, F asterisk CK, I didn't even do anything wrong. O'Malley successfully defended his bantamweight championship with a dominant decision win over Marlon Vera in the main event of UFC 299 in March. Sugar won the title after knocking out Aljamain Sterling in the second round at UFC 292 this past August in Boston, and is expected to face Sterling's longtime teammate Merabd Valishvili in his next bout. The 29-year-old rising star already was dealing with the weirdness of the situation, then was told what he was being suspected of doing from the call to local police. They said I killed my parents or something like that, O'Malley said. Yeah, they thought there was an active shooter inside, like, who is inside? I was like, no, I was just gaming. Someone called and said there was an active shooter inside, and two dead people in the house or something. The police said the caller referenced, my address. Little f asterisk ck, I wish we could find that little weasel that called them. They can't find him. But it was crazy. O'Malley was ultimately let go, and now the unexpected chaos will serve as an interesting story to tell for years to come. Please subscribe, comment, like, share, and follow for more content. Please support my channel and send it to Cash App, Dollar Director 327. Thank you for your gift, it is greatly appreciated. Thanks for watching.